guys my name is Everlech and today I am back with another pixel gun 3d video so in today's video I am basically just going to be using a weapon and telling you guys why you should not buy this weapon because trust me this weapon is terrible I bought it I used to love this weapon and it's sad that it's so bad now so with that being said let's go ahead and hop right into this video so the weapon I am talking about is the fast death it has a fire rate of 98 capacity of 28 mobility of 65 semi-auto level 37 and that's all the information right there if you want to read it so basically let's just go ahead and take this hop into a match and I can explain exactly why I hate this weapon now and just let you guys know all the information you need to know so let's just go ahead and hop into a map right over here let's go to sky island and see exactly how we do and show you guys why you should not buy this weapon. So here we go, the weapon looks amazing. The weapon used to be amazing. It used to be one of the best pistols in the game before the exterminator and stuff got really big and overused. So basically, here's the problem with it. As you can see, now it is a four shot burst weapon. So it's semi, it's not even semi-auto, it's four shot burst. And it used to be fully automatic, and that that's not really a big deal, but the four-round burst kind of just makes it feel kind of laggy when you use it. And it just makes it not worth getting because you feel like you're lagging when in reality it's just the weapon sucking, and it's not even your device. It just feels really laggy when you use it. It's not as powerful as it used to be, even when you do have it upgraded. And, well, yeah, it does look great, but keep in mind it's a fairly inaccurate weapon as, well... Look at the recoil on it. If I just sit here, the recoil is terrible. So you really got to like hold anchor that weapon. They anchor the crosshairs in the middle of your screen. So you don't have to like keep looking upwards every time you shoot. This weapon used to not be like this. This weapon used to be one of my favorite weapons in the game. If not my favorite weapon in the game. It's my first ever uh, pistol backup weapon I ever bought in the game and I just absolutely loved it at the time. And I th I got it the other day thinking, "Okay, let's see if this weapon's still good." And I absolutely, I absolutely hate it. It's terrible. It's terrible. I do not recommend anybody to buy it unless you are another YouTuber and you want to do a review on the weapon. And I really hope that Pixel Gun Company can take this thing off from the four round burst and put it back to the fully auto that it used to be. So here we go. Let's just see exactly how. I've gotten one kill, I believe, with it. And that's literally it. So here we go. Gotta stay away from that guy. He's using the Frozen Dragon. And that thing's just crazy OP and talking of OP what's up with the mechs the mechs really need to be nerfed they like quadruple that those things HP and it's like impossible to kill them now it's so hard even if you get all three of your ninja shurikens on them from up close you, they're still alive you, you still haven't killed them same thing with the samurai it's just they're just like they've gotten really overpowered and I don't know what they're doing with all the gadgets they're making it really easy to do gadget spam and very very annoying for the uh, actual players who play the game not just the noobs so here we go lucky gunner i swear you were in a game with me earlier please stop following me it's very very creepy so here we go we're coming over here to take out z warudo and see exactly how i could do so it's a very very inaccurate weapon yes i do not have the best accuracy but when i use other backup weapons i do a bit better than I do with this one as this thing's just so inaccurate you definitely have to go for these headshots with this weapon and well I hate the burst. I just absolutely hate the burst. They should not have any bursts in Pixel Gun 3D. That's just not the type of game that it is. So let's see if I can get a kill right here. So got to get up really close. Come on. Oh, I got to reload. Got to re Oh my gosh. Well, I just hate the weapon. Do not buy it. Definitely do not waste your money. You could easily get something better. I believe the Hitman's even better than this. And the Hitman's trash. Now it's trash. Maybe at lower levels it might be pretty good. But at these higher levels... It's trash. Basically, if you don't have one of those area damage weapons or you don't have one of the laser weapons, like the laser revolver and stuff like that, then you're just doing something wrong. Let's see if I can get that. Okay, I only hit one right there. Come over here. Let's see if I can get him. There we go. Got three kills. So it's not the worst weapon if you're playing in like a crowded area where people are highly damaged all the time. But like, if you're playing in a map like this, it's really not the best because... It does, like, no damage, and the accuracy is terrible. Got another kill right there. And, 
you have to get those headshots. If you're not getting those headshots, you're not going to do good with this weapon at all. So, oh my gosh, he gets fat hose, guys. I don't know if you guys know that, but that man gets fat hose, like stupid thick. But here we go. We're going to go over here and see if I get another kill on Lucky Gunner. No, I cannot. But there we go right there. So I had four kills with this weapon. Whenever I used to use this weapon, I used to be able to get like 20 bombs in the games. Keep in mind, the skill level was a lot lower back then, as most players just straight up sucked back then. But it kind of sucks that one of these great OG weapons that lots of us OG players used to love so much just absolutely suck now but anyways guys that's gonna be this video if you guys did enjoy it make sure you guys leave a like and comment down below what you guys actually think about the fast death in 16.2.2 let me know if you like it let me know if you hate it and let me know why or why not you like it or not me personally i literally if they would just take off the very very high recoil and if they would take off the semi-auto and just make it fully auto like it used to be then that'd be perfect. That'd make the weapon back to what it used to be and it wouldn't be too terribly overpowered as well. If you guys do want to see more content, make sure you guys leave a like and comment down below some other OG weapons that are or are not good in the game and so that, that way I can do a video on them and you might even get a shout out in the video. If you guys do want to see more content, make sure you subscribe and turn on the notifications and with that being said, I mean the best way you guys can support my channel is to just share this video wherever you can with whoever you can. Discord, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, wherever you can, share it. It helps me out so much. But anyways, guys, with that being said, I really hope you guys all had a very, very blessed day. And with that being said, I will see you all in the next video.